Hi, my name is Amber, and I'm just your typical teen from Anderson, Indiana. My best friend Kayla and I entertain ourselves the best we can in this small town. My boyfriend Gary and I have been together for three years. He's a certified nursing assistant, and he spends his spare time playing video games. So, how did I meet Gary? That's a good one. You see, Gary graduated high school with my older brother, Sean, who's in Iraq now. One day, when I was in 10th grade, Gary called the house looking for Sean, and guess who answered? Hello? Is Sean home? Nope, he's out shooting squirrels. Amber? Gary? Amber, who are you talking to? It's Gary. What does he want? Mom, Dad, and my brother were not too happy when I started dating Gary. Yeah, you're still a little baby to me, Amber. So you can imagine the reaction when I laid this one on him. I'm pregnant. A baby is coming out of my freaking Dude, it's your fault. Are you serious? Y'all know why I'm pregnant. Why? Because you don't like condoms. And I was too stupid to make you I never on. said I didn't like condoms. We may not have planned on having so a baby, ridiculous. but we're definitely keeping her. So we decided to move in together. Oh, get your feet off the couch. I just washed them. <laughs> like an alien. My best friends are taking it pretty well. I might not have time to go to the mall and do my nails, but we still have lots to talk about. How are you gonna decorate the baby's room? And we're gonna make like a big collage and hang it above the baby carriage. It's called a carriage, right? Sure. What's it called? <laughs> crib. <laughs> that thing. You need to know that I never thought I'd be here right now talking about a crib. I didn't even want kids. Before I got pregnant, I was a rebel at school. I dressed different than the cheerleaders and I was a total party girl. But that life is ancient history. Oh, look at that one. Oh, that's so cute. Most kids my age are shopping for back to school stuff, but I'm in the baby section shopping for baby stuff. With Gary and Toe bitching about money. How much are these? What the fuck? After baby shower, we can always come back. Money's tight, but as long as we're careful about what we spend, we'll be fine. We went to school together. Oh, yeah. Did you graduate? No, not yet. You're a senior? No, I was a senior last year, but I'm pregnant. Uh, well, <laughs> yeah, I guess it happens. Yeah. But I'm a senior. Yeah, good see to see you. I hope everything's good. Hey, good luck. Good. Did you see the look she gave me? Despite my mom not liking Gary, she decided to come with us to hear the baby's heartbeat. I hope Gary doesn't say something stupid. We took most of the precautions. Too late. Shut up. Shut up. I what you told me. At least I'm with the guy who I lost my virginity with. As a matter of state, you're still a virgin. I was. It was oh, a miracle, yeah. baby. We haven't been having sex for three years. I'm making love. Making Whatever, love. making love, Gary. <laughs> That's what we call it. Hi. Hi, Amber. How are you? Good. Shall we check your belly? Yeah. Okay, let's do that. Excuse me. Okay, well, let's hear this baby here. She does. Where's she going? She moves around a lot. Yeah. It's kind of the average. Okay. There you go. A tissue. Or a napkin. <laughs> Are those hot <laughs> kind of Thank you. Okay. Enjoy your meal, and I will be back to check on you. Thank, Thank you. you. You're welcome. Just because you're pregnant don't mean you can eat, like, all this. I'm not eating anything completely bad. I'm eating a grilled chicken sandwich, a salad, and some cheese fries. It's fine. I just want you to be happy. I don't want you to get sick. Hi, Amber. It's Hi. good to see you. 
Yeah. Gosh, I haven't seen you forever. How you doing? Yeah. Just being pregnant. I didn't know until you came in the door. I, I think I've never met you before. I was going out yeah. with him when I worked here. Yeah, you were? Have you been yeah. seeing him that long? Like two and a half, two and a half years. years. Wow. Were you guys talking about getting married? Um, mm. Yeah. I mean, I would love to marry her because I love her with all my heart. It's, it's a lot to do with uh, her family. Oh, I mean, I'm pretty sure her dad wouldn't care. Completely. But her mom, I'm not sure yet. Yeah, well, once the baby comes, that'll help. <laughs> it's good seeing you guys. Take care. Bye-bye. Yeah. Hey, you think your mom will get along with my family? Yeah, if your mom tones it down a bit. She's pretty rambunctious. I ain't feeling it now. I told you, you should eat some fries. Grease does not set with a pregnant woman's tongue. We found a crib at a garage sale for $15. I need a flathead screwdriver. We don't have one, but I got a butter knife. Since we're scraping for cash, we need all the help we can get if we're going to make this work. Oh, my God. Okay. Thank you. Sweetie. Thank you. You did a good job. You want to wash your hands from touching that old crib? It's so weird. That crib being up like that is like. I know, it's just weird seeing the crib. It's okay. You're having a baby, sweetie. Just think when you see the baby. I know. <laughs> Hey, baby. Are you freaking serious? Did you just buy that? Yeah. How much was it? It was like a couple hundred dollars. What's a couple hundred? Like five. Five hundred dollars is not a couple hundred. A couple means two. That's money we could be saving up for the baby. I got money. I'm no, you saving. don't have money. I'm working overtime. Oh my god, whatever, Gary. Wanna play? No, I don't wanna play. Where are you going? Baby, don't be mad. So I'd be afraid to quit my job right now anyways. Because I don't know if I can count on hearing the pet sales. Yeah. I don't know if I should tell any of this, but he just bought him a brand new PlayStation 3. It was $500. Why? I don't know, Mom. Because yeah, I told him I needed... This priorities all screwed up then. Yeah, yeah, I know he worked hard for his money, but, you know, he's the one that got himself into this mess. Well, we both did. Mom, just don't tell Dad about the PlayStation, okay? Hey, Dad. Are you going to come to the barbecue? I'm feeling all right. I'll be there. I have choice somebody in here. Mm, I'm sure mom talked to you. Is he there? No, he's he's not here right now. He's upstairs. Um Yeah, but there's more important things in life than toys. I shouldn't toy. No. I mean, you still have to death. I know that. And he it does sound like he's helping matters too much. Alright, well I'll talk to him privately. Yeah, that would be good. Bye, Daddy. Me off for real. What? Because they care you about you, me? No, why'd you tell your mom about the PS3? You said you wouldn't. It makes me look like an ass. Uh, because I you are an ass for doing it. There's money in the bank. No, there is not. Like five dollars. Yeah, money, stupid money. I hate money. Why are you so mad? Because if you your mom needs to shut her mouth. Oh, you won't say that to her face. Well, what does she call me? An inbred piece. If my kid was 17 and she got pregnant, I don't uh, care. Yeah, well, she I'm can the still. She way. can still. She can go somewhere. I am a teenager. You have to understand. You do I understand. I do understand. Well, then I'm stop. having a daughter. It hurts me that you did that. You don't care. About what? About me. 
Because like, ever since we've been together, it's like he's changed. Ever since, it's like getting older, it's like he's turned more into an Oh, okay, Philip, it's burning. You're the one that, you know, knocked her up, so. I said, if you keep on acting like this, I'm not going to be with you. The good thing about living right near my mom is I always have a place to go when things get tough. We're going to get a stroller. I need to buy, you know, all this stuff for the baby. So everything's expensive. Babies aren't cheap, man. Yeah, the baby's not even here. Yeah. You know, I'm broke. So this is your room? I love this room. Being in this room makes me realize how much my life has changed in these last few months. I wish I could just, like, go back. Have you heard from your brother? I was texting him. He's supposed to call during the cookout. Kind of sucks. It's like the time where I, w I need him here the most, he's gone. Because he's like the closest person to me, you know? When is he going to come home? They're trying to get him home November 1st, but I hope he's here before the baby's born, though, you know? Sean's been away for seven months, so he's never seen me with my big belly. If I could have any wish in the world, it would be that he'd be able to leave Iraq and come home in time for the birth. Got my hair cut. My mom's gonna be here soon and I'm not ready. Okay, we'll get ready. It's 4th of July weekend, and the families are about to meet for the first time. Look how big a thing is. Feel it. It's how hard it is. <laughs> I hope everyone gets along, especially our moms. Mommy. Very important priority. The family's first. The toys got to wait. She had told you about the PS3. I told her that the reason I, I was getting it because they were making it no more. But then I went out and I worked like like a million hours overtime. I know, Gary, but baby's first. Actually, Amber and the baby's first. Yeah. You know. Right. <sighs> Gary, you got something to put under this when it's hot. Hi. Uh, three Hi, Jeff. <laughs> Mom. Hey, Tony, this is this is my yeah. There's more. This is my mother, Carol. Well, that's Tony. That's Amber's mother. Well, I think I actually seen you when they were looking at the car the other day. At that time, I wasn't really too happy. Wow. So yeah. I was I was still at that shock stage. Oh. I went through the shock thing, but you know, I was like, okay. <laughs> Outside. But then everybody ran outside. That's the first time you met his mom? I've seen her before. You've seen her? you just seen her? My poor little Amber. What have they done to her? She gave permission to allow her to stay in his room overnight. Amber did not allow to have boys in my house. She even gave him an extra pillow while she was ovulating. Amber, is your mom going to come in and join us? They're all eating okay. Well, if things weren't weird already, this cookout certainly didn't help. Just when I was about to hit rock bottom. My brother's trying to call us and go outside so I can try to get reception. Bobby. Hello? Bobby. Yeah, I can hear you. Oh my god, I miss you so much. What you been doing? Huh? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> She's crying. She's having a cookout. She's got the family over there. I'm over right now? Yeah, except for you. I know. I need you here right now. I know, but you're the closest person to me in this family, and I'm going through all this and I just need you right now. Mom told me that she told you it was a girl. Yeah, I put on my life, but I don't have to go right now. Uh, I gotta do something, but I'll call you back, all right? I love you. We love, love you. you. Love you. Later, man. Love, love you. you. Love you, Sean. Bye, Sean. Love you. Love you, Papa. Bye.
Give me your foot. No. Give me your foot. No, let go of me. Okay, put your foot over here. I'm gonna like, just pick it up and bring it to myself. So yeah, thank you. Your feet smell good. I can never stay mad at him for that long. I helped clean up your mom. Despite all the messes he makes, he's my man. I love you. Yeah, um, I had a question. I just found out I'm having a baby. And, uh, I purchased the Metal Gear Solid um, 80 gig value pack for the PS3. Mm -hmm. And I was wondering to you know what your return policy is on those. It's my life. It's all love. Fall's here, and while most kids are figuring out their class schedule, Gary and I are at the library researching baby names. Heather, Grace, Judith, Gloria, Rachel, Anna, or Annie, Barbara, Linda, Jennifer, Ruth. Ariana? I don't know, like, Ariana, come here. You like Kumada? No, honey. Amelia? Mm-mm. I got one. Number one, Leah. I like it. Who'd all you invite to the baby shower? Everybody, but <laughs> Kayla can't come. She's out of town. Does your mom still hate me? Hate's a strong word, but yeah. Oh, you look oh, so cute. Yes, Mom. I love you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I got here. Whatever just... happened to it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You and my mom, like, we're thinking uh, the same cool. exact it thing or something. Group, it wouldn't... Okay. Daddy is our best dad. Yeah, <laughs> little... The little photo mm -hmm. thing. For her dresser. Yeah. I'm going to buy her a dresser and a okay. couple other things. The daddy guide. I don't need no daddy guide. Well, at least they're not married. Yeah, no kidding. I hope this tension between our families doesn't last forever. Even though being pregnant kept us away from the big game, Gary and I are spending quality time with our friends at home. Don't eat all that. You need to save room for dessert. I'm freaking starving. I'm giving my damn food. <laughs> what was that? We're happy and life is good. Sapphires, uh, the heart one. The heart one? I, that's her style. It's got a lot of bling bling. That's for sure. $21.40. Do you know what your return policy on it is? Uh, 90 days with the receipt. If something goes wrong, you never know. Right, you never know. Thank you for holding this weekend open for me. I'm going to take you somewhere special. Yeah out of this house for a while. Oh. Aaliyah can come too. I think she'll have to. So. And with that, we hit the road for one last romantic weekend in the country. Oh, oh my God, it's so beautiful out here. Let me show you your room. We'll get you all comfy, then you can be on your own. All righty. Sit down in business. Dude, your feet stink like They do not poo. Carry. Hey, I'm doing good. Start doing mine. No, I'm pretty much pregnant on you. Sorry, We're both having a baby, remember? No, Gary. Do they have like a garden or anything? So we're just going to chill over here. Is that comfy? Yeah. And it's springy. Sit. Oh, um. Sit. Come on through. Hold on. Sit. There was something I was going to ask you. What do you mean? Huh? What do you mean? What do you mean? I was wondering if you would marry me. No. 
It fits me, my fingers are swollen. I'll fit. <laughs> so, I mean, I want to ask your dad before we actually, you know, get married, but I was wondering if you want to marry me. Yeah. I know mean, we fight, but everybody does. And I know with us having a baby and everything, we need to have a complete family. I want to be there for both of you guys, so. Yeah. Simon? Yeah. I love you so much, Sorry. huh? I am the happiest girl in the whole world. I just hope my family doesn't get in the way. I, we have something to tell you. We went to bed and breakfast. It's so nice. I know that. Um, well, we went out on the porch and all of a sudden he got in front of me and he kneeled down and asked me to marry him. Oh, yes. <laughs> Gary's mom was not the one we were worried about. Yeah, Amber. I just hope my mom takes it well. He proposed to me. Congratulations. Well, I thought you maybe you guys would no. snuck off and got married. Mommy. Really. Then you did everything else, asked backwards. <laughs> This year, no trick-or-treating for us, but Leah dressed up as a pumpkin. <laughs> That's adorable. And even our midwife got into the spirit. How are you doing today? Happy, Happy Halloween. Halloween. We want you to get delivered by 40 weeks, OK? okay. So that's less than two weeks. If you don't go into your labor naturally by your due date, then uh, we would want to induce you okay. so that your baby doesn't get too big, OK? OK. Um, did you think about pain management during labor? Yes. An epidural. <laughs> the thing with the epidural is get it only if you need it. Yeah. OK? Yeah. Don't have it be like your first thing. Even though you have an epidural, when you push, most of the time I try to do a lot of different positions. Do you know what the bar is, the squatting bar? Uh-huh. You can sit on the edge of the bed, kind of lean over that bar, and squat kind of like you're sitting on the toilet to okay. push because well that's good. pushing a baby out is a lot like pushing a poop out oh my God. okay, okay. <laughs> my due date came and went but i had to wait five more days before being induced hey baby this is it you're coming home with the little baby girl I'm so ready to have this baby. Hello. Hi. So how are you feeling? Um, I've been puking all day long. No, what's going on with that? I don't know. But how come you can throw up and then eat Taco Bell? I don't know. I don't get it. I don't know. <laughs> At all. Are you nervous? Uh-huh. I feel it. I'm sorry, Amber. Now we have the Pitocin. Okay, it's going to hook right into your other IV fluid. And this will help induce labor. Liquid labor. Liquid labor. Once this really hits your system, you'll start to feel more contractions and they'll get a little bit more intense, okay? Just keep reading like you said. I keep having contractions. Her uh, contractions are getting bigger and longer. They're gonna get a lot bigger. I need something. Please, Joy. Okay, I have to check you first. I can't. Please stop. Okay, Amber. Please take a stop. nice big deep breath. Just listen to her. Just keep breathing. Oh, please stop. Amber, you're doing great. You're 100 percent thinned out. I'm ready for epidural. You're ready for an epidural. Yay. <laughs> Let's give her the epidural. She's doing better. It's a good epidural in that it's helping your pain, but you can still yes. move and 
I have my contraction. I feel the tightness. Yeah. Much better, huh? Yeah. Well, I can tell you love her a lot. Yeah? Even though we fight and say things, I still love her. Yeah, everybody's gonna fight and argue. Yeah, yeah, totally. She's feeling some pressure in her butt. Is that a good thing? That's a very good thing. I think <laughs> that we can have her start pushing and we can kind of get ready for this delivery, okay? Okay, I want you to put your hands right here. Okay, taking a big deep breath. Push down hard into your bottom. Hold it to the count of 10. Yeah, okay, let's see. Yeah, yeah, push, 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 push. Hard. Really, really hard. It's doing perfect. <laughs> Is the head showing? Not yet. I mean, it's no. in there. Take the sheet and pull on it now when you push. Okay, take a couple big deep breaths and rest in between. And push. Push, push, push. Push really hard into your body. Come right back at it. Keep going. Push hard. Push really, really hard. You're doing great. <laughs> doing anything. It is. It is. Let's change position a little bit. Okay? That's a girl, just like that. Good job. <laughs> Use your head. Not yet, yet. Keep going, you're doing great. Keep going, keep going. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And push. Push, push, push. My God, is there any progress, please? Yeah, there is. Yeah. Every push counts. Do you want to touch her? No. Okay. No. Can Gary touch her? No. Okay. <laughs> this is a lot of work, isn't it, Amber? It's a ton of work, I know. Mm -hmm. I want to see section. I really, I really don't think you need a C-section. I just can't get out. I just want to see section really weak. I know you're weak. No, I can't. I'm really, She's really cool. weak. Can I give it up for you? I can't push. It's doing so good, though. You know, let your body just do its own thing for a few minutes. I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay, I'm just gonna check and see if the baby's moved down anymore since, okay? Honestly, the baby is really right there. I really think you could push this baby out. You wanna try it? Sure. Okay. Is everybody ready? Yeah, we're ready. Okay, you got a contraction? Push down hard into your bottom. Good, Good job. job. Keep going, come on. Oh, yeah. Come on, come on. Doing great. Come on. Oh, great. You're doing great. Push. Give me that baby. Let's see. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh, wow. Oh, again, right again. Big breath and push. Push hard. Beautiful. Oh, hair. That's a bunch of black hair. And I need right you now? to give me a huge push. Yeah. Yeah. A long bit. Push. Sit, baby. It's a girl. Does she come with any instructions? Congratulations, it's a girl, it's a girl. Yeah, she's so cute. Precious. Looks like she got Gary's face. <laughs> Boy, this is fat. Yeah. While other kids are studying for their finals, Gary and I enrolled in Baby yeah, 101. Ew. Is it poo? Ugh. Honey, that's so way too good. Patty cake, patty cake. Bake me a cake as fast as you up, can. Up, roll it up, roll it up, throw it in the pan. No. Baby. Before we knew it, it was time to take baby Leah home. The heavy lifting that includes laundry baskets and stuff like that. And even pushing a vacuum. Yeah. And she loved the dishwasher? To. Shut up, Gary. Just nothing heavy. We suggest during these four to six weeks, no sex whatsoever. 
okay? If you notice, like, you might be a little more tearful now than you were before, crying at stupid commercials. Okay, the weepiness is okay. Hello? Okay. It's your brother. <gasps> Tomorrow afternoon? Yeah, okay. We'll tell her that. Oh, my God, I'm going to cry. All right, bye. Who is that? Her brother. Oh, He's been in Iraq for a while. He <sighs> calm down. <laughs> is this part of it? Yeah. My brother Sean was finally coming home from Iraq. He wasn't too happy about Gary and me hooking up. But now that there's a niece in the picture, I'm hoping he'll be okay with everything. All right, she's bundled up. She's ready to go outside. She looks fake now. She looks so cute. Look at you. Oh, oh. I knew delivering my baby would hurt, but I never imagined I'd be in this much pain. They do not teach you this in high school. It smells so good in here. Hi, Mom. Even though it was a school night, thank God Kaylin came over to give us a hand. <laughs> all your laundry's clean, and I washed your sheets for you. I washed the bottles, all of them. Thank let, you so much. Let you guys do your mom and dad thing. Bye. Bye. Okay, put her in. Here you go. This thing's so soft on her. I know she's comfy. Put it in here, girl. I love you, baby. No more. Leah wants a brother. family gathered in anticipation of my brother's arrival. As you know, Sean was not happy about me and Gary being together, and I was scared he'd make a scene. But to my surprise, he set the past aside and acted like a complete gentleman. Hey, sis. I'm so sore. Oh, God. Oh, oh God. Hi, Mom. Oh, my God, you do look different. What's up, man? Gary. What's up, dude? Hello, me on your bones. <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> She's cute. You were missing yeah. cute babies with Gary. <laughs> totally. But the joy of a new baby and the joy of seeing my brother soon faded as reality set in. I really need that dresser to be done sometime soon so I can actually put all these clothes in her dresser. What the hell, there's a diaper on the floor. Note to self, or to you actually, like if you fill up a trash thing, it like bring it downstairs. Hey, I'm busy working. And then I come home and take care of a baby. Oh my God, cry me a river, you. Gary. Even with Gary picking up extra shifts, money was still no. tight, as we had all sorts of new expenses. Formula, diapers, clothes, and toys. Add that to constant cleaning and lack of sleep, I found myself on the verge of losing it. Oh, what? Oh, we need to get sleep. You didn't get sleep. I didn't get sleep last night. How many hours of sleep did you get? Four. Okay, now listen, I do that four days a Bro. When I work exactly. 40 hours in the weekend, and while Just you do is stay home and take care of the little one, which I would rather you do. You get more sleep than I do working those 40 hours. And you can be sleeping right now, but you won't argue. I can't go to sleep right now. You got the light on. You're over here pounding on the baby. She's crying. Are you crying? If you don't want to watch, you don't have to. I'll do it all. Tonight. It's not about wanting, Gary. It's about needing to get sleep so I can make it through the weekend. Okay. My mom will watch her one right. day. Does your mom need to watch okay. her when she has a freaking father watch her? you're complaining about watching her, Amber. I'm not complaining. You are so lucky right now you're holding the baby. Why, are you going to hit me? <sighs> All right, 
dulu ya. Things mellowed out, and Gary and I settled into a comfortable routine. Gary. But as soon as I started getting some rest, she's breathing heavy right now. You can hear it. Something was going on with our baby's breathing. That's what I'm worried about. Yeah, um, we were needing to get an appointment for uh, our daughter. She's having breathing problems. Like, she stops breathing, and she kind of gasps for air sometimes. Do you know how the procedure works? Yeah, uh, what we're going to do is dump her nose up with a nasal spray, and then we're going to place our scoop through her nose Upper airway, so start to finish. Usually, it's about a five-minute procedure. Um, the, well, they told me that there's gonna be like a, there might be a nosebleed, so this kind of worries us. Yeah, it's it's pretty rare. Gonna get tomorrow. The doctor will explain everything. Okay. Okay. Thank you. We'll see you tomorrow. I don't want to see him stick it up her nose. You know, I worry about her. So Leah's seeing a specialist in Indianapolis to find out what's wrong. Hi. Hi, Dr. Alchoa. Good to see you. Hey. <laughs> How's Leah doing? Good. Good. Sleeping. Perfect. Yeah. So what we're going to do today is a procedure called flexible bronchoscopy. It takes uh, about five, ten minutes to finish the procedure. But preparing it will take more time. It's OK. So this is the flexible bronchoscopy that we're going to use, and it's it's very small scope. It's very flexible, so it shouldn't hurt her, and we could move it up and down. And it has a camera and a light at the end of it, and we could see the picture here, these two screens, and we'll record it. Let's see handle this. She's okay, honey. It was supposed to be like tiny, like that's bigger than her nostril. They're 10 minutes already. We're done with Leah. You guys want to come on back? Oh, <laughs> come on back. Her little nose is red. Oh, let me show you what I found. So this is her voice box here. These structures called the glottis. These are cartilage. In her case, it's very soft still. Goes down and cover most of her airway. Every time she take a breath, it make it smaller, so it become like a whistle, and that's why she's like, <gasps> with time will go away, but so you don't have to worry about it. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Oh, welcome. Okay. Have a good day. Relief yeah. flooded in with the good news, but I gotta tell you, this parenting thing is not easy. You're okay. Then again, Our nobody said it would be. sing to us. Every constellation in my heart <laughs> Dancing on a river all night I would climb to the moon <laughs> What a long Pretty road this has been. Never in a million years could I have foreseen what having a baby would really be like. And it's just weird seeing the crib. My whole life has changed now that I'm responsible for this child. I need you here right now. Well, Gary and I have our disagreements. Five dollars not a couple hundred. A couple means two. And being parents is a challenge. You don't care. About what? About me. We do our best to spread the love. I was wondering if you would marry me. Right now? Give me a huge push. And oh, Gary wow. never ceases to surprise me with his random acts of sweetness. Her tongue at me. <laughs> <laughs> no one said being a teen mom was going to be easy. Ahead lie many unanswered questions. Like, will Gary and I actually get married? Will we have more kids? Will we ever be able to make ends meet or buy our own home? Am I just too young to handle all of this? It's hard to tell. As long as there's a happy family behind her, she should be 
a good person when she grows older, you know. I think we're doing pretty good so far, so we'll see how the future turns out. I would do anything for her. That's it. <laughs>